Hi, I'm Christopher Rokas, actor, director of both stage and screen. I want to tell you a little bit about who composed The Phantom of the Opera. Actually, there were actually two composers. One is Ken Hill with the Ken Hill version of Phantom of the Opera, um, and also the very popular Andrew Lloyd Webber. Uh, who, well, produced the Andrew Lloyd Webber version uh, musical of The Fan of the Opera. Both adapted uh, from the 1909 uh, novel by Gaston Leroux, uh, originally published in French, uh, translated to English in 1911. Andrew Lloyd Webber, uh, a prolific uh, composer. Um, he's a, he won uh, seven Tony Awards, three Grammy Awards, an Academy Award, a Golden Globe Award. In 1992, he was knighted. He also got the Kennedy Center Honor Award. Uh, there may be other awards that I'm even forgetting. So he's a, a, a well-renowned. Uh, also, uh, his London-based the uh, London theater company, uh, one of my favorite names for theater companies, the really useful theater company, as opposed to the not useful at all theater company. I think I worked with them in Tampa. Um, but seriously, uh, Lloyd Webber did an excellent job. Um, um, uh, he has a knack for putting together very uh, uh, popular musicals, sometimes not as critically acclaimed as, uh, you know, as other composers. Now you're saying to yourself, well, Chris, you listed those, you know, litany of awards. Sure, but we know sometimes awards don't necessarily mean directly to uh, to critically acclaimed talent. Um, I enjoy I enjoy almost all of his musicals, but specifically the Phantom of the Opera holds a special place in my heart. Those powerful driving beats of the main overture and the. Uh, um, and the title score uh, to the very high um, tubular bells inside of it. It's, it's, a, it's an absolutely wonderful show. So if you like Phantom of the Opera, check out Lloyd Webber, check out his other work, and give Ken Hill a try, too. I'm Christopher Rokas.